What's up? Welcome again to Joe's Coral Reef, another unboxing video. Today we have the Milwaukee MC122. What's up everybody? Joe's Coral Reef here. We're just cutting into the box to open up this Milwaukee PH controller. You know, there's a few different controllers out on the market. You've got Pinpoint. If you want to spend a little extra scratch, you can get the Hanna one, which is really what I wanted, but it finally came down to cost. And, you know, I do trust the Milwaukee brand. I use some of their other products. So I, you know, I felt comfortable buying the product. And this controller's been around a while. So we'll see how it works out. Until you actually use a product, you don't know, right? So this isn't a review. I'm not telling you to go out and buy one. I'm just unboxing this just to give you an idea what comes in the box and how I'm going to use it. You know, it's nice. It has four mounting holes. So you can mount it to a panel, uh, which is what I'm going to do with it. The pH probe it comes with is a dual junction probe, which from my understanding is a little bit better than the basic pH probes. It also comes with this mounting kit that you can mount the pH probe. Uh, it's just a suction cup with a ring. It's, it's kind of cheesy. I can't imagine using that. And then it comes with this small screwdriver. So when you're using the calibration fluid, you can adjust the calibration point of the controller with this small screwdriver. You notice that box in the top right corner there. So you plug that into your outlet, and that's the controllable uh, outlet. So based on how you set this pH controller up, it's going to turn that outlet on or off. There you have it, Milwaukee pH controller. So there you have it, the Milwaukee pH probe. We've unboxed it. I know it wasn't that exciting. Um, but I'm going to bring you more videos, setting up a calcium reactor, uh, CO2 tank, you know, the regulator, uh, solenoid, needle valve, the reactor that I chose, and then tuning it in. We'll do a whole series on that. I believe this is going to be an integral part because, you know, a calcium reactor, what it does is you take old coral, basically distant relatives to what you have in your tank, you inject CO2 in there, and when the CO2 gets to a certain point, it um, basically lowers the pH, right? When you have a certain amount of concentration of CO2, it lowers the pH, causing that calcium carbonate to melt. And basically, that melt goes into your tank. I think it's effluent or something like that. And it's, you're dosing your tank with calcium, alkalinity, any type of trace elements that were in that dead coral. Um, it's kind of like coral cannibalism, right? You're melting down the distant relatives and feeding it to the new coral so it can build a structure. So this, what this is going to do is monitor that, that swing, that pH swing. When it goes too low, it's going to turn off the CO2. My one concern is the probe, right? I know this is industrial type, it's a dual junction, but it is the one failure point. If this probe goes bad, and it says it, let's say it reads that the calcium reaction chamber is seven, but in actuality it's five. Um, you know, you're dumping all that low pH water into the tank, which could cause a crash. I don't know if that's possible. I'm not very familiar with these pH probes and how they fall out of calibration or fail, but it is one of my concerns. And, you know, I'm, I'm getting away from the GLH and the Apex controlling the whole system. You know, Part of the problem I have with them is sometimes when you have one issue, it, it cascades to the whole system and takes everything down. And I'm trying to develop these individualized monitor and control systems. So with this though, I might need another controller to monitor that pH just to shut this down just in case. Um, it's kind of like a controller for a controller. But we'll get to that. When we get to it, we get to it. So anyway, stay tuned. We're going to have more videos, calcium reactor stuff, all types of stuff. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Joe's Coral Reef. Oh, someone told me this is my exit. I, I, I really hope that's not my exit. I'm not going to do that ever again. You're never going to see that. I'm going to carry this pH probe around with me. I'm going to be like, I'm out, dropping the probe.
<laughs> I don't know. My battery's got to be dead. Stay tuned. More episodes. Joe's Coral Reef. See you later.